should be working now. Yes, it is working. Although, I figured out, Tonic's fucking horrible. Hmm. Hmm. I have nothing to say about that. I have, like, fuck, yeah, I have, like, vodka and tonic here, bro. Huh? I've drank, like, <laughs> half of, like, one of the bottles. Fucking tonic is horrible. Vodka tastes fine, but... Yeah. Isn't that kind of that end something? I like vodka, yet I hate tonic. I don't know. I I have no idea about alcohol at all. I don't drink it. Although tonic's not alcohol. Yeah, but I mean, I can't... I have no opinion because I can't even be near it, so I have no clue about that's, that's any of the enough. nuances towards it. It's like when people talk to me about, like, smoking versus vaping, and I'm like, mm. I don't see a difference. Like, Although I can pretty much say differences on that. Yeah, like, to me, I don't see a difference. I guess maybe one's just, like, you're not inhaling fumes, you're just inhaling, uh, like, Vaporizing steam. safe, though. Well, yeah. so they say. We well, we haven't mm -hmm. gotten any conclusive I, I, I scientific think evidence. Pretty much has less cancer cells in the you know, thing. It has less carcinogens, as yeah, far as we it. know right now. There are less cancer-causing agents. However, you're still burning your throat. <laughs> you are not wrong. <laughs> That's the thing that gets me when people are are smokers or even vaping is the idea of just like I'm going to breathe in this searing hot, you know smoke and or liquid and just be cool can't really that. talk yeah it doesn't make sense to me i can't really you know yeah, I, I can't well, have any comment on that because i smile yeah well that's that's what i mean you do so you you do have experience regarding it but i can't like you know comment saying you know <laughs> <laughs> okay about that because then it's like yeah burning myself it's like well mm. well yeah that's kind of what i'm doing yeah, I know I'm doing it, but like, it's hard to stop. Yeah. It's like, it, nah. it's like myself with freaking Souls games. I know that they're not mm. good for me, but here I am every freaking, you know, other day playing one. They don't give you counsel though. Well, they, they facilitate the possibility of getting it by making me not get exercise. Hmm. It's all yeah. about how you look at it, man. If you look at it but like... With what I do... I don't get, uh, I don't have exercise, and I pretty much inject cancer into myself. <laughs> inject cancer into myself. Well, I smoke it into myself. But yeah, I was, was going to say, like, I, I've never heard of somebody just being like, you know what sounds like a good idea right now? Injecting cancer. That reminds me, actually. Because <laughs> there was, like, this, um... <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Sitting there saying stuff like, oh, man, injecting cancer, you're just like, hmm. That reminds me. Also, hello there, Liz. Haven't seen you in a while. Hey, Liz. <sighs> you sound quite happy. It, it has been a while. There, yeah, okay, uh, this is this is going to throw me off. I have two screens in front of me, right? Yeah. And one of them is broadcasting what's on the other one, but it's broadcasting about two seconds behind because there's the natural lag, right? And yeah. if you're recording using an Elgato, it straightens out that lag. It goes, okay, mm -hmm. so the voice is going to happen about two seconds randomly, you know. It feels like it's been forever. It has been forever. It, it fucking you should, has, You yeah. should come by once in a while, but, uh, you know. It'll be nice to talk. It's been too long. This is a thing. Yes, this is a thing. Um, Demon Souls is a thing. Yes, hello there. Uh, hello, makes work. But, um, anyway, the, if you're, if you're streaming from an Elgato, uh, Usually, it tries to even it out if you're just using the device itself, right? Yeah. But if you are um, streaming it through, like, OBS or whatever, there's just, like, the noticeable two-second difference because it's it's trying to stream it while you're also live. So the audio mm. comes through first, and then the video comes through. <laughs> so uh, you, you, were, you were around a little while ago, and then you left because we were playing Smite. I'm going to go ahead and say... I don't know, something like that. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm very pleased with what's going on already. Also, I'm going to put cancer into myself. Going to put cancer into yourself? Mm hmm. I don't think you should put cancer into yourself. It's, it's a slow way of doing that. You're not wrong about that. So, I was dead for about two weeks or so. No, you came by said, 
hey guys, or something along that effect. Oh yeah, I remember that. And then he yeah, just and then, didn't. And then you, yeah, and then you left. You were here for a little while unless you got hacked. I know you came by last time we streamed. I remember that. <laughs> also, I have proof as well. Oh, oh. Hey. I, I, I miss playing this game. I also have proof because I have the um the ready chart. Oh yeah. So I remember Sorry. why I loved this game so much already, like immediately into the character creation. Oh, prior to that I wasn't there. Okay, well Oh okay. Yeah, we knew about you know, being absent before that, so Mm. Yeah. Skin color flushed. Pigment, light. Okay, so now they're white. No interweb sounds terrifying. Yeah, welcome to me last winter. Remember when my <laughs> power went out for like the four days or the three days? <laughs> yep. Yeah, didn't have internet. It that was... didn't seem very long ago. Yeah, you know, it it's one of those things. It's like how I said the other day, uh, you still have your Christmas avatar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so... You know, there you go. It's like my Halloween Christmas one, actually. Halloween Christmas. I yeah, you just kind of modified it and made it both. Yeah. It's it I is like pretty modify terrible. For like every season ever. Oh, it's also Easter because it has the Twitter egg. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So I'm gonna say that's also Easter. What other holidays can I make up? Uh, this is not a live bag. You are right. It's not a live bag. Um. We have sort of reached this conclusion where everybody's going to be kind of occupied in a little while. And I've got college like two weeks. Yeah, you've got college. I've got college. Nick's got a job. And mm. you wouldn't be able to, and I don't blame you, you know, keep both of these things going because even though you've done it in the past, it's kind of one of those things that's unhealthy and it's not great. Um, and Nick. Because then it means I get like maybe two hours of sleep at my house. I still have my Halloween Twitter avatar, but no one notices. That's the thing, though. It doesn't matter, because yours is pretty much just perfect regardless. It's it's great. It's pretty good. I keep changing yeah. mine all the time. But, um, yeah, like, Nick's going to be busy. And you're going to be kind of busy, and I'm going to be kind of busy. So what we're just mostly going to do is uh, we're going to still stream, and somewhat regularly, but also irregularly. In that, um, dependent on, you know, how occupied we are, we might not be able to, uh, like, buy a schedule. So, I mean, we you know. Yeah, Nick's, at, well, like I said, Nick's got a job. He's going to be cleaning up the fecal matter of students. Does he do that weekend? I don't know. Uh, I, I think he's, I think he's busy until Sunday. I don't know. Okay. I don't remember. I don't remember exactly, but he said that it starts soon. Sunday would be the only time he'd have off. So effectively, we're putting the uh, the live bag on hiatus, but we're still going to be streaming. It's going to be a bit more casual. It's going to be content that wouldn't necessarily be covered, you know, stuff like that, and uh, hopefully, you know, grows the audience a little bit. Like I am going to try and play some games that I don't like, but maybe you know, sitting around talking about it with other people would make it more tolerable. But once like, sorry if you hear wind. yeah, I heard wind. But, yeah. <laughs> I can't help that. I'm just, uh, that. I'm, I'm waiting immediately now for Rachel to just load in enough to see the terrible abomination that I've created already. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's, there's so much beauty in the Souls games. There really is. Mm. <laughs> there we go. Got it. I got what I wanted. I'm Can pleased. I'll see You'll see chat right This is a Souls game. What did you expect, honestly? Like, let's be... Let's be serious here. What did you think was going to happen in this? This is how it goes for you. Excuse me? This is how it goes for you. It's going to be as practice. Dear lord. I can't fucking wait to see this. It's not wrong. Yep, I'm not wrong. Solera brightness. I love this one because you can change the brightness of the Solera, the white of the eye, right? 
So I always make them have like red slash black eyes, so that way I can just make them have like the worst type of thing going on. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. They've just got like red eyes. They have legitimately red eyes. That's pretty cool. This is this is amazing. <laughs> oh man. It's like you don't know me at all. It's not the most horrifying one? Are you kidding me? This isn't the most horrifying one I've ever made. What's the more horrifying one that I've ever made? I'd be into knowing what that one was, because then I could uh, play on that to figure out which ones would more horrify you. I don't know. Were they horrifying? <laughs> Did you I'm expect him not to make an abomination? You're very right. I am actually quite curious, like, what people even would think that I would make other than something like this. Oh, you suddenly just got real quiet, man. Did I? Yeah, you're very, very quiet. I can barely hear you. That shouldn't happen. Okay, now you're sounding a bit better. Oh, I hope so. Okay, so my face is almost about as flat as a pancake, so... I'm I'm really happy with this. <laughs> oh man. So I, I have no jaw. Like at, like at all. I have no face at all at this point. This is brilliant. I like how your character looks right now. <laughs> this is so good, man. I, He's um, really sexy. It's a she. <laughs> She's really sexy. It even says female monster girl. <laughs> the, I can't the, I couldn't fucking tell that was a female. <laughs> I switched the, uh, I switched the, what's it called, the, uh, hormone slider <laughs> all the way to male, and then just continue. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, I thought that was a male. Mm. Jaw width. Shows what I know. Nah, jaw width narrow, lower Can't jaw. Don't judge anyone by their faces. You shouldn't judge people by their faces. I saw, it looks like a weird bird person thing. You see... I was saying earlier how I made a toucan by accident one time, so there, also tweet. <laughs> if you wanted to tweet a picture of this, go ahead. Go for it. I'd be okay with that. So their face is so tiny at this point, I can see where like the mesh outline is at some points. <laughs> Which is like something I really, really enjoy. I like that. Hmm. <sighs> Fuck it. Check your privilege. Wow. Who's checking whose privilege over what now? I'm just gonna open some beers now. Somehow I turned them back to a relatively normal skin color, and I'm not okay with that. Hmm. I have like half a fucking kind of yeah. Damn it. Okay if I'm not drinking that. Okay. It's fucking horrible. Come on. Tonic. I don't like tonic. Well, that sounds like a personal problem, to be honest. You should try tonic. I really shouldn't. Isn't it just like fizzy water? Uh, I think it's like really, really bitter water. Well, I'm a very bitter person, so that would work out well, I guess. Yeah, I like bitter shit, but that's horrible. <laughs> uh. Well, all I think right. like the stuff in it sort of like helps fucking treat malaria and shit like that as well. So I, I wish I could. Here we go. Open. Yeah, you know that's pretty great. I want them to have the sad expression, but I want them to have very open lips. Oh my god! <laughs> ah, I love it. I love everything about this right now. Hmm. Just wait till you see, like, how big their lips are at this point. Alright. They just, they have literally no face. All lips. <laughs> this is so good. That's fucking great. Okay. Uh... I'm gonna miss the live bag schedule, but I totally understand. Yeah, well, like, that's the thing. There, there might not be a schedule, but I'll still, like, announce 
when stuff happens. I know you don't follow me on Twitter, but uh, by the way, follow me on Twitter. I know you have an account. <laughs> I know as well. Yeah, so just, like, just, it, it would at least just keep you updated. Otherwise, like, I don't know. I'm not going to personally cater. But stuff happens, uh, like you said, so, you know. There's nothing I can really do about it. I have to go to college, so. It's kind of a prerequisite for what I want to do in life now. So do all. I always go to college. Damn college. Is it a prerequisite for what you want to do in life? Not really. Oh, well, there you go, then. I just have to do it. <laughs> it's not really a reason, but okay. Okay, so this 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 dark blue lipstick is like not dark blue at all. All right. All right. So let's try bright red. Well, that's white. <laughs> okay, that's that's pretty red. That's that's really red. Okay, I've I've completed my mission now. This is uh, probably the best that I'm gonna get out of this. I could I could go the inverse and squish their face inward to like the nose and the lips and make them just have no face at all. But I, I prefer the idea well. that they look like a surrealist picture where they have just no jaw and cheeks and they're all cheekbones and like yo know, nose and mouth. So mm. they have the saddest eyes. It's like they're just depressed that I've done this. <laughs> I'm I probably made something very similar to this on Dark Souls, let's be honest here. It's. I wonder what happens, you know, to, to this person's like face before all this happened. Uh, nothing, nothing. They just—they've always been like this. Just always been like that. They've always just been this this disturbed horror of a creature. And Rachel's gonna get her wish. I am actually stopping. I bet that person's like fucking parents are like, yeah, I don't know what fucking abomination we mind. <laughs> Uh, royalty, that's the class I want. They come with the rapier and the magic ability. Yeah. Rapier is necessary for one area that I'm going to be going to. Uh, especially because I want to play as a magic character. Um, yeah. you know, having the ability to regen magic is always nice. Having a bit of extra stuff is always nice. Mm. Uh, yes, I want to play the journey to the nexus, just in case. Never know. Hmm. Oof. So, um, my ceiling fan recently broke. Oh. Yeah, I'm I'm real scared now, like all the time, because I don't I, even have a fan. <laughs> well, I've got a little fan on on the floor, right? And yeah. I have a ceiling fan, and the ceiling fan stopped. Well, it was mm -hmm. turned on. So yeah. I reached up and touched the ceiling fan to try and get it moving because I figured maybe it got like stuck or something, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, the the metal was like hot to the touch, so I had to just turn it off. And I'm scared that I have like an electrical problem that's gonna like light my house on fire. Also, I have like no central heating at all over. Good lord. Hmm. And Rachel, I know you enjoy the you know watching and. You know, talking to me and all that, but you have to acknowledge that this this sort of abomination kind of comes with the territory by now. Oh, I think she's beautiful. Oh my god, they they look so much better in game. She's beautiful. They they look so much better in game. It's it's great. I love it. I love everything. Yeah, about probably. This. I'm going to take a brief second though, and I love uh, it. put up a. That's pretty great. Thing. I need to just handle something, that's all. Alright. Sorry about this, guys, but, uh, got something that popped up, so. I thought you would be used to this. I thought she'd be used to it too. She's seen them in person, so to speak. Hmm. Well, like, I mean, we play enough, like, privately, right? And mm -hmm. sometimes I make, like, really decent ones, but then Nick and I started playing, and his character looked like a normal woman, but she was all discolored and weird, and he's like, I think my character might be a lizard. <laughs> and then, uh, I started. A character, yeah. and they're just like this naked, ugly man. 
and <laughs> uh, he just has like the widest face and eyes. Ah, stupid damage. Uh, but yeah, he just has like these huge wide eyes and he looks like he's stoned all the time and I got the demon great hammer just by chance from the uh, uh. From the thing and I didn't even have the the prerequisites to use it of course cause it's 50 right Turns yeah. out you can totally use the demons great hammer <coughs> to just make your way through the game uh, Without yeah. having the prerequisites for it Okay, the the damage that it does Two-handed even without the prerequisites is about 200 damage each so it's pretty good. It's, yeah, it's it and by uh by the end of playing um mm. a few areas, three people, you know, going and getting summoned each time, right? Uh mm -hmm. we had enough souls that I could actually just run around with it and be able to wield it, so that was pretty great. And okay. then my, my damage like, went up into like the eight hundreds. <laughs> but even like before you have the requirements, uh for it, doesn't it like, um, don't you still like have the weird animation like, when you attack? Uh, no weird animations I mean, in Dark Souls. I mean, the bouncing off one. Uh, no weird animations in Dark Souls 2, remember? Yeah. Don't you still get the bounce off or not? I don't remember. Nah, it just goes and slams. That's pretty good. It slams and welcomes to the jam, man. Yeah. I hate how this... Uh, one thing I hate about this game and subsequently you know, other Souls-type games, is that a lot of the times you pick up an item and then the item is just automatically equipped. Oh, if yeah. you know what I mean. Because uh, a lot of time I'll be, like, cycling through and be like, why do I have late moon grass or whatever? And it's just really mm. irritating. Yeah. Also, man, I'm very yellow right now. I've been playing too much Neverwinter, I've realized. I've not asked. No, I mean, I noticed I've been playing too much because uh, I went to pause a game once and I clicked alt. And that's like how you yeah. pause Neverwinter. Even though there's <laughs> yeah, there's yeah. no real pause because why would there be, not online. you know, that. No, because there's online that can't really be. I haven't watched much Demon Souls gameplay. Well, prepare not to watch much as I do quite badly because I haven't played in a while. Yep, missed my parries both times, god damn it. Yeah, that's what you miss one. Ah, I don't... This is the problem. I play Souls games, right? But then I switch to another Souls game, and the parry mechanic is totally different, and so is every yeah. mechanic. Because they've changed it every time that they put it out. So it it feels yeah. different, and the frame rate's different, and I'm talking as opposed to playing by myself. And it, it's one of those, yeah. like, I sound like I'm making excuses, but for me, they're legitimate causes. Damn it! Damn it! Oh, no! How good I'd be at a parrot in the first Dark Souls now, because, well, you know, like, this is I could, like, stop it for months and then just be fine. This is the weird thing. I came back to Demon's Souls a little while ago, right? Mm. And when I did, uh, I just immediately was just parrying everything. And now I can't do it at all. And that's really just quite indicative of how I play games. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh, got one. It's that I get so well adjusted to one type that when I have to adjust to the next type that I'm just not good at it anymore. Yeah, because now you know Dark Souls, I could just be on the power and just be absolutely fucking fine, just parrying shit. Yeah, like that's how I went for my Soul Level One a lot of the time as well. Yeah, like a a big problem for me is judging distance of the space you need to parry too. Yeah. <sighs> I hate this guy so much. Fine, I'll shoot you with magic. That didn't even piss him off. Astounding. Well, there we go. Parried him. Now, here's where I'm pretty much guaranteed to die against a boss. <laughs> it's yeah. not it's not even a hard boss, it's just that the uh the rapier does so little damage that you're basically Doesn't just he like, poking uh, at something. He won't shot you though. Mmm, more or less. He doesn't necessarily, but you know. Uh, okay. It's just, just this character is not great in terms of DPS output, so you're mm -hmm. Your strategy is kind of strafe around and shoot him with lasers. And okay. that failed. Well, uh-oh. <coughs> One thing that I, I do have to say, though, is this game is a lot less forgiving than the other ones. The, the damage that you take in this is just no joke comparative to the damage that you take in the other ones. 
Alright. It's kind of like comparing new Zelda games and old Zelda games. Uh, the the mm -hmm. new ones are good. They're a lot more refined, but they're they're very forgiving comparative. Yep. 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 Okay, well, oh, I yeah. can't parry this guy, apparently, so... So these fucking moths are just attracted to my screen. Why do you have issues with moths? I've always wondered that. Um, I think it's because of where I live. Yeah, what, you're like the moth capital of Guernsey or something? Um, yeah. <laughs> it's my house. Moth capital. No, moth capital. Moth capital. <laughs> no, I'm fucking drawn on Spain. That's another thing I'd like as a shirt. Moth capital. Yeah, that's my house. It is the moth capital. <laughs> Just a picture there. of a house and then a bunch of, you know, moths around it. Yep. Just moths. That's where they all just go to hang out. <laughs> oh. One thing that I I did like about this game a lot more than Dark Souls 2 is the stamina meter and the magic meter are separate. <laughs> and that, yeah, so that yeah. sounds like a really minor gripe, but like, I just I. I don't, I don't see the point to having a, a magic meter and a limitation to your amount of magic that you can use. Mm -hmm. To me, it's just like, that's just handicapping you a lot. Ooh, yeah. I think I might walk myself into a corner here. Nope. Skillful dodge. Nope. Okay, I'm fine. <coughs> I'm fine. Okay. Please stop. I want to just... Oh, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> See, like, I'm really used to fighting this guy as other characters that have better weapons. Mm -hmm. So it's just one of those, like, I'm really not a fan of pew pew magic at this guy. Yeah. Oh, like, every time he, he freaks out, I expect to take some stupid damage, and then I expect to just die because of a freaking roll resulting in a critical. Mm -hmm. Alright. Also, don't talk about ice creams. I have no ice cream. Yeah, that's why. Like, if you don't have enough ice cream to bring for the whole class, don't talk about it, okay? I haven't had it in years, either. Jesus Christ. That <laughs> that's... That's a hard thing to imagine. Mm, I haven't, though. Yeah, but, you know, it's... It's one of those, like, first world problems things. Be first like, world problems, I've never ice cream in years, go. Yeah, no, like, that is pretty much a first world problem, though. It's like, we didn't have the money for, you know, ice cream. Okay, so, my freaking... I haven't got money for much. My freaking lock-on uh, unlocked for some reason, and I ended up wasting huh. a bunch of shots. That's not good. I ended up killing them, though. Yay. This is also why I have no central heat in mono. Yeah, I was going to kind of assume that, but... Okay, what button is mm. the button for that again? It's got heaters, that's, that's but we're not going to switch God those on. I don't remember... I'm switch those on. I don't remember what it is. Oh, there we go. Gesture menu. Oh. Uh... Sigh. <laughs> I love it. I really hate the gesture menu in this, though. You have to, like, hold oh, down... Gonna, uh, you have to hold same. down the X button to get it. Oh, X, okay. The gestures are so much, like, more animated in terms of how much movement goes into them. But, generally speaking, there's, uh... There's a lot of issue to it. At least in my uh. mind. Uh, da 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 Ah. Well, time to go see a sick dragon with some abs. <laughs> what? Sick dragon with abs. Oh, this dragon has some abs, man. He also has more fingers than well, necessary. Oh yeah, I have seen the dragon. <laughs> yeah. He's and, buff, you know, man. You, He's you, it freaking was in the ripped. fucking when you play your chef as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I uh I'm trying to course Rachel to get the game and she's just like sobbing. Hmm. Considering she sobs at Dark Souls, not surprising. This game is ironically darker. It is quite dark. 
both in terms of the story and in terms of uh, the actual atmosphere. In fact, when they were talking about Bloodborne, they were saying that Bloodborne has the feeling of the Tower of Latria, which is a very, very uh -huh. dark area. And hold on. Uh, he has five fingers and a thumb. <laughs> he's also freaking ripped, man. He's got he, 12 fingers. He's Yeah, he's also got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten abs. He's got a ten. ten. Pack. He's got a ten pack, man. Temper. <laughs> he has an extra I've finger about... and a ten pack. Yeah. All right. And he's gonna falcon punch me. Falcon punch. Boom! I'm gone. You don't get up from that. <clears throat> He ground yeah. my face so hard into the freaking stone floor of the sanctuary that he's in. Watching his hands is fucking hilarious. It's pretty great.